Hey you and welcome back to some Sims 4. We are here with the Watson family. Now I started this house in a live stream a couple of days ago and I finished it up you know in here afterwards and I've had some people send me messages and saying but we you know you didn't give us a tour of the house yesterday so we're gonna have a quick tour of the house here um, while we let the Watson ladies get on with their lives. Work starts for an, in an hour for Amelia so we don't have a lot of time. So anyway, we are here in this sort of, um, I don't know, to me it feels very kind of southern New Orleans style with the big porches, the big trees, the hanging moss. It's a really, really pretty neighborhood. I mean, this is in the back, for goodness sakes. They have no room. I mean, the yards these days, the gardens are really tiny. But the surroundings are pretty amazing. Look at the wrought iron bridge over here. We're just going to have to take a walk with these characters one of these days and have a look around because this is really, really nice. Very beautiful place. So here's the little house, which I think should be named. I don't know what to call it, but, you know, we'll get there. It's That's for later. Uh, we'll start here on the first floor. You can see, you know, we've got lots of white, some green with the shutters and things. You put some plants out on the, the veranda gots to have a veranda. Here is the, uh, let's see, here is the opening with the little hallway here. Now I think part of this is going to change because I think I'm going to need the basement for this, these two and I'm going to have stairs up and a set of stairs going down. So this is going to change rather dramatically here shortly and I hope we can still make it look half decent. Now this was sorted out during the live stream um, by, yeah, this is grandma's house. And apparently grandma's a pretty cool lady. She is out. What? Okay, you know what? Hmm. I'm gonna say, oh no, I was gonna say I'm gonna join and pause immediately. So much for the tour, guys. We're we're going to work. Well, there you go. We're going to work. <laughs> Foiled. Okay, well. <laughs> I wonder if we can just leave her go, you know, do her cluifying all by herself. Um, all right, come on, game, move. Okay, so she is at the police station and is there, you know, can we just pick her at home? Can we just go to her? I want to just go home. Okay, what do we have to do? We've got to add clues to the crime map, cross-reference the database, and get the fingerprints. Well... All right, you know, we did a lot of stuff yesterday. We picked up all kinds of clues. We took a bazillion pictures. Uh, we were just, oh man, we were some, doing some serious, serious work here yesterday. Um, yeah, we were just being all total lead. Now, the thing is, yes, we also had the opportunity to, or the, the job to use the computer to do some stuff. And, um, couldn't do it because you know you couldn't get anybody off the bloody computers so let's add got the wrong girl selected go and add clues see if we can deduce come on go deduce my darling deduce away you know have you these guys are all supposed to be working oh he's a cutie isn't he um come on, they're chatting they're chatting yeah they're on the computers that i need Suspect is a loner. Analyze the evidence. Okay, we have to go. Uh, the police database, which you will notice, is on a computer. Where is this? At the booking station. I don't even know where that is. Now, you have a notebook. Yeah, you have a notebook. Let's analyze some evidence, please. Do you know how long it took me to find the notebook? Okay, here's the thing. It's on the phone right here. I never use my phone. <laughs> never crossed my mind. The phone was like the last place I looked. Literally, it would have been. There was no place else to look. I clicked on every blasted button in this, this game. It was crazy. Oh, look, now we can check the database. No, no, no. <laughs> good, good. Thank you. We got in ahead of her. Okay, uh... I, let's do all the things. Let's put, let's put, we have, we have so many things. We have so many things. Cross-reference the database, stick in some photos. 
Oh, somebody's over here giggling away. Very cute. Cross-reference the database for um, anything else. We'll stick in another report. What the heck? And we will do one more crime scene photo. What the heck? Analyze more evidence. I don't know stuff. Okay, with, let's check this out. What's in our, what do we have? We have a teenager, female, tank top, and a loner. Who do we know? Do we, have we met people? Maybe we know her already. Wouldn't that be just awesome? A female with a tank top. Well, unfortunately, it doesn't look like we've actually chatted with a female in a tank top. That, that's really unfortunate. That's something that's really bad. Logic skill. Ooh, we're just all logical and awesome. All right. Where is the booking station? You would think that would be out here somewhere. Fingerprint. Oh, Madame Hugshot. Oh my goodness! Seriously? Okay, we we have to bring them in. So what do we have to do? Like I don't even I don't even know what to do. We've analyzed evidence. We have to analyze more. Seriously? I have so much. We even did some like homework analyzing last night. But did she get to eat? No, go to the bathroom. Hygiene. She's just kind of smelly and gross. This is fun. All right, do that when you're done. Do that when you're done. It'll help a little bit. We can add some clues. I love this map. Ah, that's cool. Analysis failed. Well, yay. So we're going to have to do it again anyway. You know, the life of a crime scene investigator is not what it's cut out to be. I'm just saying. Where's the sexy outfit? I don't know. I mean, look. I mean, this is like this uniform thing. I don't know. All right, uh, sweetie. Yeah, move. Do something good. That's my girl. Okay, well, your hygiene is at least not any worse. So we have to issue an APB. Finder, arrester, get her fingerprints, and book them, Dano. Oh, yeah, this is going to be cool. Come on, where are you? Amelia, Amelia, come on there, darling. Oh, I love it. Look, we just got this things and the lit. This is like when you write a book. I used to put this all over my wall. It was awesome. Deduce a clue. You can do this. Add clues, more clues to the crime map. Okay. They, they just keep giving you this stuff. Look at this. What's the time? I'm not going to make it. Okay. Let's just issue an APB. Do it. Issue an APB. We can do this. Okay, you know what? We have to work late. Oh, no! They didn't let me do it. Uh-oh. Usually, you click on that, you have a choice of just going home early or uh, maybe something else just popped at the same time. Or you can choose to stay and work late. She's been working a lot of late. You can now deliver your baby at the hospital, and why would you want to? You can just stand there in a room, pop them out straight into the bassinet, on schedule for god's sakes all points bulletin okay um we are going to be staying late obviously now it works at seven okay she's like woohoo this girl's hyped let's see who do we have to arrest we have to arrest a female teenager with a tank top who is a loner and with shorts and a tank top black hair okay we've got a black haired teenager in shorts and a tank top uh is she do 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 I know anything about her? You know what? She's not in shorts though, is she? Oh, so close. Could she have changed? With the black hair. Come on, it's Bella Goth. You know the. <clears throat> Take this as it's meant, okay? You know what those goth people are like. <gasps> okay, now here's one. Look at this. You know what? Let's let's talk to her. Let's talk to her and see if we can find out anything at all about her. If she's a loner, we got we got this. We're just we're just taking her out. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Funny, talk. Get over here. Get over here, girl, before our suspect leaves the country. Where is she going? 
Okay, get to know. We need a definite get to know. Um, ask about, I don't know, more choices. Friendly, get to know. I need a get to know. Brighten her day. Before we arrest her, we'll just make sure she's having a good day. Because, you know, it seems like a nice thing, right? We could talk about fitness because get to know. Please tell me she's a lunar. She hates children. Oh, well. She's a teenager. Of course she hates children. She says, I grew up having to babysit the little blighters. Fire her up. Woohoo! Let's get going, yeah. More choices. Friendly. Discuss interests. Ask about career. Oh, she's in school, of course. Come on! Do it! Do it, do it, do it! More choices, friendly, get, I need a get to know. No! I need to arrest her! No! Ah. Well, we've met her. We've met her, at least. I think that's, you know, that's a, that's a thing. We've met her. That, that'll be good. It'll all be good. <clears throat> Foiled. <laughs> Well, I'll finish the tour, <laughs> and then we'll go track down our our spray painting culprit later. Well, I made some money. What a day at work. Okay, I'm, I'm in a playful mood. That's good for you, Amelia. Okay, let's have a look at this house one more time. And uh, yeah, here's the tour, the people who got to see it start. So it's Grandma's house, and Grandma is a pretty neat lady. She's got her two grown grandchildren. Um, she is a young adult, and Anna, the older sister, is, well, the older sister, and she's going to be a doctor. She's decided late in life she wants to be a doctor, so she's heading for that, but not there yet. Uh, while Grandma is away, the girls are living in Grandma's house, so it's kind of an old-fashioned house. Now, they've, they've made some changes to their own rooms and stuff like that, but you, you can see it's... Um, you know, it's an old-fashioned sort of place. It's very much a an Ava kind of house. I really, really love this place. Great big washroom, toilet, lip, privy, whatever you want to call it. It's kind of nice. The colors are great. We have a parlor. There's not a television in sight. Isn't that fabulous? Um, Grandma collected chickens, so we've got like chickens all over the place. And then, you know, she's brought back artwork from some of the exciting places that she has visited in her life. And... Uh, you know, we'll have something from the Himalayas for when she comes back because she is climbing the Himalayan mountains. Grandma is a pretty cool old lady. And, uh, you know, they had a, a themed wedding. Uh, Grandma is not actually this old. <clears throat> but when they got married, they had a themed wedding. So that that's a, that's a wedding picture. You know, she was doing themed weddings way before that sort of thing was cool in gaming circles and whatever. Here is the kitchen. And you can see we have, you know, more chickens on on hand. There's a little medicine cabinet up there for goodies. And um, Anna is a great cook. Anna has just taken off. Look at this. When, when she cooks, it's like everything sparkles, right? Sweetie, where are you? You should be in the kitchen eating the sparkly food. Resume scrambled eggs. Um, yeah, all right. Well, whatever. You guys do something like that. Here's the dining room. There's another chicken. Uh, those beautiful art um, rose prints. I, I used to have a set of those. I had six of them. I loved them. They were so nice. These botanical prints are quite famous, actually. So that's the dining room uh, with spoiled food kicking around. I think these girls have hired a maid, but I could be wrong. I don't know. Then we go upstairs. Woo! And you come up the hallway here, and, of course, there is... um. There's, well, I was going to try to open the door like in Minecraft. Isn't that fun? Out back. <laughs> I was like, my door said opening. Click, click, click. Uh, here, look. Oh, she's good. Let's just spray the lighter fluid all over the hot dogs. Mmm, no, that's going to be fabulous. So they have a tiny backyard, but they've made good use of it. And there's one of the kitchen chairs sitting up there instead of being... Uh, Okay, fire. Again with the fire. What have you caught on fire now? Okay, this girl is just a walking freaking accident, isn't she? Like, she just 
Every time she touched, this is, she's only ever cooked anything twice. You've seen both of them. She has started a fire both times. And that made her flirty. Okay, we have a problem. Oh my God. The fire made the lady flirty. That's good. That's just brilliant. I think we have a story there. Yeah, we definitely have a story there. Okay, go eat your awesome lighter fluid covered hot dogs. It goes so good with barbecue sauce. There is a little back balcony there. They can play. That's where Amelia works out. Um, this is their hallway. This is um, Anna's room. Anna wants to be a doctor someday. She's, you know, got to this stage in life and said, you know what? Life is not over yet. My goodness, Grandma is climbing the Himalayan mountains. So I think I'm going to start. Um, I think I'm going to start that. Yeah, for sure. Not sure what, what she's collecting here. I haven't decided if this is booze or, you know, something else that's interesting um maybe it's just booze maybe that's why she needs to be a doctor maybe her liver's not in great shape oh god excuse me here with the ah, with the camera yuck okay then they can both come into this little back hall to get out on this patio up here um again place to sit little you know eating area if you want and this is where we have some analyzing in the the tool here um, Anna's got some x-ray stuff that she's been picking up. And this is Amelia's room with all her police stuff. Now, the reason she's totally into police stuff, I've unlocked the things so I can have these on the wall for decoration. I've decided, you know, her parents were police officers. They won all these awards and commendations, and that's what inspired her, you know, now that she's old enough to go to school to be a, a policeman or a detective. These are, you know, a couple of serious big bad guys that her parents caught that you know saved the day and made them heroes and all that fun stuff and uh, sort of a mini version of, of the big um, crime map at work she's got you know just some stuff stored up there for those odd times when she's not in uniform and then they both have got just two little minimal bathrooms tucked in god the mouse today um, right there so they're both going to sleep that's good awesome awesome and that's the house, the house that Ava built a couple of days ago. And this is the Watson household. Tomorrow, we are going to see if we can't um, get to know our, um, whoops. Oh, look at this. Poor Anna doesn't know anyone. We're going to see if Elena is our problem. Bad, bad Elena. Oh, well. Be you ne here next time for the big arrest. Whoa. Until I see you next time, live your life happy. Build it beautiful. Bye-bye.